Welcome to WSJ Live. I'm Christopher John Farley. I'm here with our guest, Michaela Maroney. Thanks Hi. a lot for coming to the Wall Street Journal. Thank you for having me. Now, it looks like you've got a new deal going on here. You've endorsed a new line of yes. low-calorie sodas. And tell me a bit about this. This is our new 7-Up 10, 10 calories, perfect for, you know, a better choice for you. And me as an athlete, you know, I'm trying to get back in shape. I want to go to the Olympics again. So this is perfect for me, and I'm finally impressed. I've had, you know, that non-impressed thing. So this is my new thing that I'm impressed with. Now, of course, you're a gold medal winning gymnast, won the so, silver in the vault, yep. uh, became famous on the internet for the meme where you had this not impressed face that yep. even President Obama got in <laughs> on the action and did the not impressed face in the White House. Now, when something like that happens, something like that goes viral, did you think to yourself, how can I? profit off this or how can I actually get involved in this since everybody else is doing it? Um, I mean, I didn't really think how can I profit off of this. It was more of how can I turn this into something positive where, you know, people enjoy it, people laugh, and I want people, you know, to see me for who I am and not for a girl who is standing on a podium and not impressed with her silver medal. So it wasn't that. It was more of me just, you know, I had an off day and I landed on my butt for something that, you know, I didn't want to land on my butt for. So I turned it into something positive and yeah, you definitely have to be smart, but you know, I'm, ter I'm finally impressed now, so that's the good thing. <laughs> now, these drinks are put out by Dr. Pepper Snapple Group. Yes. And I, I, they're 10 calories for a 12-ounce um, can, right? And I guess you're going to be sort of marketing them using your impressed face, yes. correct? Which is the opposite do of your... Do you want me to teach now, you how to do it? I, would I don't know if I can learn it, but okay, I would love I, to see it. You, I don't think it's going to work on you me, have but to can learn I see it? Because you have to see, be impressed uh, with let's see now, your but I'll show you face. how. Okay, so you do thumbs up, and you're just like, like that. That's it. That's all you have to it do. It was it was the face I did after I stuck my perfect ball at the Olympics. <laughs> so it's kind of just like, oh my god. And you know, can you even drink 10 calories? I mean, can you add that to your training? I mean, is that something you would drink if you were training? Um, yeah. I mean, everybody needs a soda now and then. I mean, I my coach would kill me if I walked into the gym with a a soda that had a bunch of calories, but I showed them this and they're like, okay, that's all right. I was like, good. Now my coaches are impressed with it. So I can walk in with that and feel confident. <laughs> now, now you're also moving into acting. You are in Heart of Dixie a couple times. Do you plan to be on that show again? Are there any other acting roles you plan to take up? Yeah, my new episode of Heart of Dixie is March 5th. It's coming up and it's real legit acting. I have a couple of lines in my own part in it. So it's really exciting and it's something that I've wanted to do my whole life. So I was very happy that I got to, the chance to do that. But now I'm starting to get back into the gym and you know, stuck in the gym all day, don't really have time for anything else, but... Uh, now, you injured yourself not that long ago. How is that rehab coming? Do you expect to get back to your sort of Olympic form? Yeah, I mean, that's definitely something that I strive for. Not only do I hope to achieve to get back to where I was, but to get even better than where I was. So, um... It was hard. I mean, I'm already back in the gym now. I had three different surgeries on my tibia and on my toe. I got some screws in, got some screws out, so I'm good now. <laughs> uh, do you expect to compete at the next Summer Olympics? Is that something you're aiming towards right now? That's something that I am definitely aiming for. Well, thanks a lot, Michaela, for coming Thank to the Wall Street Journal. I appreciate that. Thanks a lot. Thank you so much. Great.